one mile in fog patches and showers early Friday, but improving to greater than six miles on Friday morning. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel, La Casa de Natasha. And uh, yes, this is our Sunday catch all plan with me. And um, I am going to be changing it up a little bit this week. Um, so I have this new mini uh, setup that I've done, mini happy planner setup. I will put a card here so you guys, if you missed that video, you can go check it out. I'm in love with it. Um, and in that video, I kind of play around with the idea of possibly maybe moving into a mini as my catch-all. Um, I would really love a planner system that I could take with me on the go. Um, and uh, what I've decided to do with this mini planner is it has daily sheets. I have some daily meal planning, budget tasks. Um, and then I was like, maybe I should add a weekly to it. Um, I do love, as you guys know, I am using this Bando uh, for my catch-all currently. And usually towards the end of the year, I like to play around with different layouts, different systems, and see what works for me um, that I can go into the new year with. And the only thing I've been struggling with this, and even with a classic happy planner for a catch-all, is that... Um, I feel like I don't fill in enough of the space. Um, I don't know. Maybe I could be wrong. Like, because I look at this now and I'm like, okay, well, it looks like I really am utilizing it. Um, however, that the fact that it is a horizontal has been a little bit of a struggle for me. I'm, you guys know, I am a dashboard girl. I love being able to take notes throughout the week, to do's with throughout the week. That's been a little bit of a struggle just to like where to put my laundry list and things that I need to do this week as opposed to like each day. Um, so, as I mean, I love this planner. I love these dividers. I will never get over it. So, um, I don't know. I'm going to play around with this. I'm going to play around with a mini happy planner uh, as a catch-all. We're going to try it. And so, I kind of talked about it in my setup video about possibly putting in... Um, some weeks and so I moved October over I moved my weekly section over I should actually probably add November as well um and I'm just gonna try it I mean this is the first week I'm actually gonna try it let's see how it goes because it is kind of small and I'm worried what if this is too small we got too big and then too small I'm like Goldilocks over here um so I'm gonna try it I'm gonna see how I like it I do need to make a little another little dashboard for uh, my weekly. Um, but yeah, I just want to see if this is something I can really utilize going into the new year. Um, and of course, I picked a dashboard layout. <laughs> um, because yeah, even in a classic dashboard for a week, I wasn't filling it out. However, my social media, I fill out pretty well for a dashboard. So that's why I'm like, I may end up going into a monthly for my social media this week. Stay tuned because I'm trying all the things. This is These are the next couple months you guys are going to see me doing, playing with different layouts, playing with different systems, um, just to see what works for me. So I've been using Dashboard for social media. It's been working really well. Um, however, I haven't really been utilizing my boxes, but I do utilize this space and this box a lot. So I was thinking maybe like the boxes in a monthly might work better for me. Let's see what happens. Um, but I love, I love trying out new things and seeing what works for me. So, okay, let's just get into it. We're going to be planning out this week. Um, what is it? The 17th and we're going to be decorating for, um, with, sorry, not for, we're going to be decorating with these Stranger Thing, Thing stickers. You guys, I've been so freaking excited to use these stickers. Um, yes, I know Stranger Things already came out, but I'm like feeling the very like Halloween vibe right now. And I'm just going with it. I'm going with it. And again, this is like, I'm like not quite used to using a mini when planning. So this might be kind of a quick video. We will see, I guess like my only other concern for using a, like a mini is that A, it's gonna be kind of quick to decorate. So 
there's A. And B, um, will I have enough room to write my plans? Will it be big enough to write my plans in? I feel like it will be because I always struggle with like filling out classic planners. Um, so this might work. This might work, but I don't want to like overly decorate because then I won't have room to write. So we're going to get into it. Um, let's see. I need, I definitely will probably need some colorful boxes. I just want to see these might work for me. Let me pull out my big one. I love this big one. And we're just going to have that set on the side right there. Um, okay. We're just going to get started. So I pulled out this washi. It's like a hot pink. I felt like that kind of went with the theme because there's a lot of like hot pinks popping out. Um, okay. So I'm just going to start. And again, I don't know if I mentioned this. I got these at five below. I got these stickers at five below and I just love them. So if I see something I like, I'm going to go with it. Okay. Let's put down some washi first and foremost. I think I am going to leave like goals for the week down here. I really like that system. And we're just gonna add in a little bit of washi, not too much washi, just a little bit, just kind of get a good, my washi kick in. Oh, is that even? I don't know if that's even. Scoot it over just a smidgen. Okay. Um, so, okay. I don't know why I'm like, it feels kind of weird being in a mini. I love this chick. I love this circle thing. Let's do, I love the glasses. That's kind of neat. We got 11 over here doing her thing. Oh, that's kind of cool. Um, and if you guys can hear, I got the kids are playing outside. Um, and you might hear them. So <laughs> just, just a heads up, just a little disclaimer. You guys might hear the kids, which I know sometimes happens. Um, I want to put some boxes here. Ah, let's see if I could find some. What do I want? Like pink? These are more gold. I do see some pinks. Oh, there we go. Okay. We also have some blacks. Oh my gosh. I'm trying to remember how I use it. Okay. So I think this was always my to-do list. This was my chores list. Oh. I miss having a chores list. So I'm going to put calls and emails and noted. I think I did one of these boxes for like next week. It was like the next week box. Let's pull out some black colorful boxes, which I know are in here. This is crooked and this is going to drive me a little bit insane. It's just a little too crooked for my taste. I'm just gonna make you a little straighter. That's so much better. I'm gonna add a black box over here. I think I also did like a box where I had like the weather, but I might just leave it like this. Um, I might need to come back to this. So we're gonna leave that there. Um, I love this vibe. This is so cool. Oh no, are you messed up, little sticker? Oh no, I got you. I got you. It's kind of cool. Super fun. I love how these guys are just like standing. I 
I feel like I also really miss the Stranger Things train. <laughs> like I'm a little behind. But it's because we kind of like caught on a little, like we started watching it a little bit later. So, oops. Got that monster over here. Uh, is that too much? That might be too. I'm gonna put this on this side because we already have sunglasses here. There we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, baby. Um. Okay, I wanted to put a little icon list here. <gasps> Ooh, I have to do's. Is there purple? Do we have like a purple? We have turquoise, pink, black. I'm gonna go back to black, I think. Black boxes. I know I have a lot in my other book. All the colorful boxes. Um, here we go. Straight, not quite straight. You're almost straight, but you're not quite. Ah, uh, there we go. That's a little better. That works. And then, what did I say? I wanted like an icons kind of situation. Oh. Oh yes, these are perfect. I feel like this might have been better. There we go. Oh my gosh, why can't I Straight. And then where's my exacto duder? I'm just gonna snip it right there. It's gonna be really interesting when I do my fill in the plans for this. Um because I think that I'm hoping that I have like enough room. I think I will but we will soon find out. Okay, got those. And then I like to put my little boxes. So this is where I might put some black. Oh, there's like, is this more teal? Do you guys think this matches? I don't know if that matches. I feel like it could. I'm gonna put that. And then we'll put another blue one up here. They kind of go together. Yeah, I dig that. Okay. I actually, I dig it a lot. We've got Max. Max kind of has like a... See, I might move this guy. I don't know. Oh, that's kind of cool. I like that. Um, and then we have we need Hopper in there. Good old hop for to do's. Let's 
I love that. We got our little Star Court Mall. Put that down there. I feel like I need a little something here. Um, oh, here. I love this guy. I forget his name though. What is this dude's name? Oh, I forgot. I forgot his name, but I'm sure you guys remember. And if you remember, tell me. <laughs> um, okay. I do want to put another box here. Let's do another black box because this is where I want to write. This is goals for the week. Okay, low, but it's okay. I have a whole nother boxes situation. That's perfect. Okay, I think, is that it? Maybe that's it. I don't know if I need anything else. Like, I feel like that might be good. Oh, do I want another box up here though? I might want to put a pink box up here actually. Just because this is where I do want to put like meals and such that I have going on for the week. Actually, maybe not. I don't know. I don't know if we need to utilize this as a meals because I do have a meal planning section now. So I don't know if that needs to be meals, but I am gonna put the monster guy here. Because that's cool. Okay. All right, that's it. That is my Stranger Things uh, layout for the week. And again, I'll be filling in plans on Tuesday, um, either in my social media or for this, but I will definitely show you guys um, an after the pen so you guys can see what it looks like. Um, make sure you're following me over on Instagram over at La Casa de Natasha because I share a lot of content over there as well. And again, these stickers are from Five Below. You guys, do not sleep on Five Below. These are more like hologram. I might save these for next year. Um, but I really like how it came out. I love the 80s vibe. I'm all about it. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for tuning in. I hope everyone has a great week ahead of them. And I'll catch you guys later. Bye.